this video is made to discuss about the dependence of internal energy on temperature so for that let us consider a real gas inside a container which is at rest this is the container inside which there are atoms okay now it is obvious that the atoms inside this container possesses first one kinetic energy because of translation vibration rotation and spinning of the atoms as discussed previously on internal energy and second potential energy due to the binding forces between the atoms more specifically because some atom are compressed at any given moment as they hit the sides and one another but both these that is microscopic kinetic energies and microscopic potential energies are hidden forms of energy which are not detectable by direct means we can only detect the noise of the atoms bouncing or feel the vibrations of the walls of the container etc as an atom hitting the wall could push on it so it would be the kinetic energy of the atoms that we are detecting indirectly and we call this indirectly observable average kinetic energy per atom the temperature so temperature basically is a part of internal energy but only a part as the potential energy part is there too which is not detectable this way as we are detecting the kinetic energy okay that is why a substance can have the same temperature but very different internal energy as an example let us take water at 0 degree celsius versus ice at 0 degree celsius they both are not having the same internal energy why because the extra internal energy needed to melt the ice is present in the water as potential energy which we call latent energy now let us consider the case of ideal gas as we can extend our discussion of real gas to ideal gas why because ideal gas is formed when we apply very high temperature and very low pressure to a real gas which limits the existence of any binding forces between the atoms hence it is very much obvious that the potential energy part of the atom remains totally absent in case of ideal gas thus for ideal gas only microscopic kinetic energy defines the internal energy which is why internal energy of an ideal gas is only a function of temperature that is u of ideal gas is only a function of temperature so this is all about the dependence of internal energy on temperature thank you